So the next branch of facial nerve that we'll be talking about is the caudal tympani. All right, so we'll be talking about the caudal tympani. We'll get to see the caudal tympani in pictures. I'll be talking about maybe the structures that caudal tympani supply. All right, so looking at this, this is the caudal tympani. And um, if this is the caudal tympani, just trace these branches. Coming down here, it supplies the submandibular gland. Trace this other branch. Coming down here, it supplies a sublingual gland. Okay? So just from knowing the picture, I can know that the caudal tympani gives innervation to the submandibular gland and the sublingual gland. Okay? The caudal tympani supplies a submandibular and a sublingual salivary glands. Okay? So it carries, it also carries taste sensation from the anterior to third of the tongue. All right? The caudal tympani arises from the facial nerve a few millimeters above the stylomyceoid foramen. Okay, so the caudal tympani is actually given off before the facial nerve exits the stylomyceoid foramen properly. Okay, so if the facial nerve is exiting the stylomyceoid foramen at this level, the caudal tympani is given a few millimeters before the exit. Okay, so it is directed superiorly and anteriorly and perforate the tympanic cavity. It enters the posterior canaliculus and then descends near the spine of the sphenoid bone. All right. So you guys remember our lecture when we were talking about fractures to the spine of the sphenoid bone. We said that the caudal tympani will be affected. Okay. And because the caudal tympani supplies the submandibular and the sublingual glands, the innervation to these glands will be cut off. All right. So um, it. It merges with the lingual nerve, which is a branch of the maxillary nerve, right? So this is the caudal tympani, and this is the lingual nerve, right? Can you see how they are merging? All right, so they are merging. This is just a description of the nerve, okay? Basically, if they said I should discuss the caudal tympani, you have to mention all this, right? They just ask you, what structures does the caudal tympani supply? Just the like sub mandibular and sublingual nerve. All right. So guys, this is it. Let's just have um, a summary before we close. Okay. So the caudal tympani, this is it. It's a branch of facial nerve. Okay. It is given off before the facial nerve exits the stylomyceoid foramen. Okay. And this is the Okay, Co okay, sorry, this is caudal tympani, sorry. This is caudal tympani from this side, okay? This, what I was tracing here was the lingual nerve. Now, can you see how they are coming to merge here? All right, can you see where the caudal tympani and the sublingual nerve are coming to merge? All right, so the final summary now, the caudal tympani gives parasympathetic secretory motor supply to the submandibular nerve and the sub lingual nerve okay so see you guys in the next tour and bye for now guys